Oh, look at you. That baby fits perfect in my sweet boy's loving arms. Look at me. You can take me to dinner soon, but not where there's only fish and bread. A place at Bosphorus on the water or somewhere nice. Well, if you want, I'll get a table for you at Bosphorus Bridge. <laughs> Very you want. soon. Ta 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 ta! Oh, oh, how beautiful! You're looking so magnificent. My goodness. Amir, you did a good job to marry her. Look, you look strong, and she's okay, too. And here's the result. Just look at her, my little rose delight there. <laughs> Cobra, you're beautiful. Shall we go? You go and have fun. Don't worry, and enjoy your meal. I'll take care of the baby and her grandma. They're both safe with me. I'll watch them. Oh, uh, you act like I'm old and decrepit. For goodness sake. Oh, I didn't mean that. You know, you were this age once. You're just like a baby. You're magnificent. You chatterbox. Your oh. tongue never stops. Will you just uh. look at her? Oh, my little darling, just look at you. So next year at this time, can we bring Aleph to a place that's nice like this? All of us? Is something wrong? You don't like your meal? No, it is nice. Do you want to go to the movies? We can have fun. There are good movies out right now. I don't know. I mean, there isn't any need. Let's eat and then we can go back. Kubra, can we talk a little? Look, I know that you've shut yourself off lately. I can't even reach you. I mean, are you mad at me because I didn't give the baby to Yigit and I didn't let you go to Kaisari? Kubra, how can I send you to Kaisari like that? Huh? I care about you. I know, Amir. Do you know what? What is it? Tell me. Kubra, what's with this attitude? Uh, are you punishing me? Both Yigit and I? <sighs> I will do what you both always tell me. I'm not punishing both of you. There isn't any reason for this. I'm just very tired. Look, we're raising a child. We're doing everything for her. I mean, there is no Kubra now or, or Amir. There's just Elif. We have to be strong for her, Kubra. You see that? That's why we need to be strong. And me too. Because of business and, you know, we're going to be going through a hard time along with the good times right now. And I, I, I need all your support. All the bad times will pass. Being awake is like a torture to me. But I am awake. In the morning, I wake up. I look around and I feel like there is a stone in my chest. It's a big one, but no one will take it off so I can breathe. It's too hard. I get up, eat, dress, and go see people. Everybody has a purpose, though. And I act like I am living. It's hard. But, but it's just... It's only temporary, and, and, and I, I know it will pass, and I, uh, I understand you. But it, but it will pass, and, and you'll just meet people, and soon everything is going to be okay. At least that's what I'm thinking, Kubra. Emir, this is what is so hard. Moving along like I am, and everyone says it will get better. I thought that I, 
I could be happy if I was out of the fishbowl and into the ocean. But I took the bait too fast, you know? Uh, okay, so we will go uh, to the doctor as soon as possible then. All right, is that a deal? I cannot get better. Cobra, why are you so pessimistic? Amir, don't push me this much, will you? I have no energy to keep on trying. If I didn't have my child, I swear I would finish it. Anyway, this is like a slow way of killing myself. It's really delicious. Mm -hmm.